How to compute the expected farrowing date of a sow. Kung bago ka pa lang sa YouTube channel ko, please subscribe and click notification bell for more updates. Here we go. A sow, breed on March 26 can be expected to farrow on what specific date listed below? A. July 29. B. July 18. C. July 11. D. July 22. To get the expected date kung kailan, mga nganak, ang ating inahing baboy. First, alamin mo ang mga buwan na covered sa gestation period starting from the time the sow is bred or inseminated. Then, get the total number of days of each month. Then, we have March has a total of 31 days. April has a total of 30 days. May has a total of 31 days. June has a total of 30 days. And July has a total of 31 days. Then, get the number of days of gestation covered each month. In the month of March has a total of 31 days, we will subtract it to 26 days, where the exact date of breeding, so we have 30 minus 26, equals to 5 days, it means only 5 days of gestation, covered in the month of March. In April, has a total of 30 days covered in gestation period. In May, has a total of 31 days covered in gestation period. In June, has a total of 30 days covered in gestation period. While in July, is anon, we assume it as X, it means, ito yung ating hahanapin, kung ilang days ang covered sa gestation period ng ating inahing baboy in the month of July. At ito na din, ang magiging pecha ng kapanganakan ng ating inahing baboy. At ngayon, ipapakita ko sa inyo, kung paano i-compute, ang expected farrowing date, gamit ang ginawa kong sariling formula. Sa formula natin guys, e-add lang natin, lahat ng total number of days, na covered sa gestation period, each month. So we have the formula, March, plus April, plus May, plus June, plus July, equals to 114 days, which is, the standard gestation period of a sow. To compute, here's our solution, e substitute lang natin, ang number of days of gestation period each month, then we have, a total of 5 days in the month of March, plus a total of 30 days in the month of April, plus a total of 31 days in the month of May, plus a total of 30 days in the month of June, plus a total of X number of days in the month of July, equals to, 114 days. Then, e-add lang natin lahat ng number of days. 5 days, plus 30 days, plus 31 days, plus 30 days, which is equals to, 96. Then we have this equation. 96 days, plus X equals to, 114 days. Then, sa math algebra guys, we need to isolate the anun value, o itong hinahanap natin na value, which is, itong letter X. To isolate X guys, all we have to do, is a transfer lang natin itong 96 days, from left side of the equation, to the right side of the equation, then remember, kapag mag-transfer tayo ng number from left to right of the equation, or vice versa, Mag-che-change ang kanyang sign, since positive number ang 96, after natin matransfer, magiging negative 96 na siya. Then, magiging ganito ang equation natin. X equals to 114 days, minus 96 days. Then, to get the value of X, we will apply operation of subtraction, then we have 114 days minus 96 days, equals to, 18 days, it means, the expected farrowing days natin is, July 18. Balik tayo sa tanong natin, ang magiging sagot natin is, letter B, July 18. And that's all, for this video guys, thank you for watching, see you to our next video. Don't forget, to subscribe our YouTube channel, and follow our Facebook page, War Agritech TV.